Okay, so we are going to go back to our Ross Palumbo. Ross, what are you what are you seeing out there? What are you learning? Well, Calvin and Nicole, the president has boarded Marine One. He came out wearing a mask. The president was walking, followed by the chief of staff, Mark Meadows. And as you see here on these live pictures, the rotary braids are starting up and Marine One is about to take off. The president not speaking to anyone, uh, just getting in Marine One. And now he's headed to Walter Reed Medical Center where he is again going to undergo tests and he is going to be monitored for the next several days. Again, sources have been telling us that the president has been running a slight fever and has had a cough. The White House saying that his symptoms have been moderate and likening it to a cold. We understand that the first lady, Melania Trump's her uh, symptoms have been even lighter. So I can hear from where I'm standing here on the North Lawn the chopper revving up and Ross, it looks uh, like they're about to take off. Ross, I don't mean to interrupt you. Is the first lady with him? You know, we don't have confirmation of that, Nicole, but we will be finding that out shortly. As soon as the uh, pool tape from the other side of Marine One begins to feed out here. Okay, is it possible that the president is already on Marine One? It looks like he already is on Marine One and it is beginning to take off on his way to Walter Reed Medical Center. And Ross, uh, just give us an idea once again, just kind of walk us through the president, uh, what he was experiencing earlier that led to him being taken to Walter Reed Medical Center. Well, Calvin, the White House is insisting that he's not being taken there because he's suffering dramatic symptoms. They are saying that his symptoms are moderate and that he's only going to the medical center for tests and evaluation out of an abundance of caution. Uh, As you see again, Marine One taking off here. Uh, If you're familiar with Washington, D.C., this is really about seven and a half miles northwest of the White House, and this trip is just a a few minutes. And as soon as we get sight of this from our other cameras out at Walter Reed Medical Centers, we'll show you that, but they will be landing uh, in front of the hospital, and it should be visible to all. But the president, the White House saying, is in good spirits, and they describe his condition at this point as moderate. Again, they have been telling us there is absolutely not going to be any transfer of power from the president to the vice president. They say he will just be there under observation for the next several days and working essentially from the hospital. 